G'day guys and welcome to my video review on Generation 1 Transformers Decepticon Swindle. Um, this guy is probably one of my favourite Transformers that was ever around in the G1 series. Um, I mean just going by his name Swindle, um, he was such a shonky character. I mean when um, Brawl got sold off by him. For spare parts and he's just a really dodgy character he made he really made the um combaticons pretty exciting um i've been lucky enough to have this guy in my collection for a very long time as you can see he's in pretty good condition no real damage no rust on his hubs um so he's an original well, I think 1986 or 1985. Uh, he comes with his two guns, which they actually come off like this, and they can be pieced together. So you can either hold on, hold on with one big gun, basically. Not much articulation with him just his arms can swivel and his legs just fold back like this of course being being a combiner none of their heads had any articulation at all uh transforming him very basic just push his arms in flip his bonnet or hood over fold his legs pop him in and that's him there basically Having the gun in, the gun put together, you just clip that in there, and there you have him in his Jeep mode. Let's see if the rub sign still works. I should test this before um, I start the video. It doesn't matter. I probably haven't done this on this guy in 20 years, 30 years. A little bit, very faint. But uh, yeah, so like I said, yeah, this guy was pretty good. Combaticons um, had a pretty good role in the G1 series, being combiner group. Well, his tech specs go a little something like this. Um, Swindle is easygoing and good-natured, but within him beats the fuel pump of the most greed-driven street hustler. Thrives on wheeling and dealing. Works for his own personal material advancement. A one robot black market uses a scatter blaster that sprays explosive pellets, gyro gun that disturbs Transformers balance center, and he combines with fellow combaticons to form Bruticus, prone to overturning on sharp turns. Oh, that's an odd one to put in there. Um, his strength is only a five. His intelligence is a nine. Cluey bloke. Um, speed's a five. Endurance and rank are both at six. His courage is five. His firepower is at seven. And his skill is at ten. That's probably why he's pretty good at his at the deals that he does. Um, well, that's all I've pretty much got to say on this guy. Just a real quick review. Uh, thanks for tuning in. And um, stay tuned and I'll have some more reviews very soon. Thank you.